There was once a boy, a young teenager, youth, named Mohsen. Mohsen is a junior in high school. He's well educated, very intelligent. He's currently seeking internships. He's currently building his career. He's been already applying for universities and has been accept accepted with a, at a full scholarship at Harvard University. He's doing very well for himself. He's a practicing Muslim. He prays five times a day. He's, he fasts in Ramadan. He gives charity and completes all the pillars of Islam. So one day, as he completed his junior year, now during his summer session, summer vacation, enjoying his time, that finishes, he has a good summer, he reaches the first day of senior year in high school. Okay, so first day of senior year. Now I'm not sure how many of you have experienced this. I have. It's a very exciting time. So Mohsen gets ready in the morning, he showers, he prays Fajr as he usually does, and then he makes his way outside of his home. Now, as he makes his way outside of his home, he says the dua of leaving the home. You know, he says, you know, and then some other ones, like some dua's, like for protection. Okay? And so he gets out of his home, he walks down his block. He hears a barking noise in the background. He comes to realize that this barking noise is a new dog that his neighbor. So this dog was outside in the backyard in the fence of the neighbor. The dog, as he's walking down the block, jumps over the fence, rushes, runs after Mohsen, and tries to attack him. Now Mohsen sees this. He's petrified, he's scared, he runs away with anxiety and fear and he runs towards his front door, his home. He opens the door, he manages just in time to get in and close the door before the dog attacks him. Okay, so he's in fear, he's, he's, he's anxious, you know, his parents are like, you know, what's wrong, what's wrong? He's like, he just starts to calm down and he tells his parents, he just makes something up, um, you know, school actually starts tomorrow. It doesn't, it's not today. I thought today was the first day of school. He makes something up, you know, white lie or a lie out of fear. So the next day, he wakes up, same process, he prays veg, you know, takes a shower, has breakfast, he's anxious, he's, he's kind of, you know, it's kind of like that, that sitting anxiety. He makes his way, you know, to Wakul, goes out, and lo and behold, what do you think happens? Same thing. That's right. Essentially, the dog jumps, you know, over the fence, goes and tries to attack Mohsen. Mohsen does the same thing again. He's in, He's in anxiety, you know, he's fearful, he doesn't know what's going on. Oh my God, I'm being attacked by a dog. He rushes, front door, closes it in time. Again, petrified, terrified, confused. Confused. Why confused? Because he was making dua as he was leaving. You know, why is this dog still harming me? He's confused. Anyway, so from that point on, he makes a kind of like a self-dedication out of his anxiety and his fear. He says, I'm not going to school anymore. I'm staying home. I'm not, in fact, I'm not leaving the home at all. I don't want to face this dog. You know, I have, obviously I have a very serious, very major phobia towards dogs. So I'm not going to go outside the home ever. Okay, so what happens? He loses his scholarship. He ends up dropping out of school. His parents don't know what to do with him. His parents are crying. He falls into depression. He stops praying because of depression. He leaves off the Salah. He leaves off the Salm in Ramadan. Leaves high school. No college, no Harvard, nothing. So obviously he's in major depression now. He's in a bad situation. While he had everything going for him, what does he do from here? Well, there comes a day, sometime after. He decides to go into beast mode, as they call it. And he says, you know what, I'm just... I'm going to step out of the house. And I don't care what happens to me. I'm going to go out of the house. I'm going to try to face this. Whatever happens, whatever percussion, whatever effect, whatever outcome, I don't care anymore. I'm immune. I lost everything already. So what else do I have to lose? So he does that. He goes out of his home. He walks down the block. And what happens? The 
dog once again jumps over the fence and tries to attack him and does attack him this time. So the dog bites him, grabs his leg, Mohsen, in a bit of a shock, but not much because you already expected it. It's just standing still and then contemplating. Why is there no pain? Where's the pain? When you get bit, obviously there's pain, right? So then he looks down and then he sees the dog has no teeth. It's a teethless dog. So then at that moment, at that point, it daunted on him that all his fears and anxiety was pointless. It was due to absolutely nothingness. It was nothing. So, Mohsen obviously regrets. He regrets everything. He lost a lot. And eventually, over time, works hard to rebuild his framework. Anyway, brothers and sisters, this was an analogy. This analogy I wanted to bring forward as an intro to connect it to what's happening today with our youth and atheism. Similar to Mohsen and the dog, you can correlate that to the youth and atheism. Atheistic thought, right? The person who comes to you and says, prove to me that your Allah exists. Prove to me that God exists. Right? This kind of like you know, aggressive kind of like, hey, give me an answer, puts the youth in a position where it's like, okay, you know, like they're, they're pretty much, they come to a point where sometimes they question their own faith. They're in a state of confusion. Just like Muslim was in a state of, a, of confusion, which we're going to talk about, by the way. We're going to talk about that specific kind of confusion that he had and how he saw something as evil when in fact, it may have not necessarily been evil. We'll get to that soon. But the point here being is, this is the challenge that the youth face today. And the real point that I'm trying to bring out is, atheism has no legs to stand on. And if you use the dog analogy, it has no teeth to bite with. 